Remembering the boy in the box, you'll remember he was identified earlier this month, decades after his remains were found back in 1957. And today, a very special mass was held in his honor. Our Marcus Espinoza was there. An emotional service today here in Fox Chase where hundreds of people took time out of their day to honor a young boy who now has a name. I actually grew up right across the street from where he was found. Yeah, so my family and I kind of uh, followed the story our whole lives. No longer the boy in the box, Joseph Augustus Zarelli the person and his soul, honored and remembered today by leaders of faith in Fox Chase, the community in which he was discovered all the way back in 1957. Never said it. The people never stopped caring when it came to the death of Joseph Augustus Zarelli. The mass on the Feast of the Holy Innocents for the repose of young Zarelli carried with it the significance and emotion you'd expect from a story that gripped not just a city, but a nation. You're talking about a young boy, four years old, who was abandoned and left to die on the side of the road. Okay, I think that would capture the, the heart and the imagination of many people, which it did. Fox Chase native Tori Minetti, along with her own son, Rocco, made sure to attend today's service and felt a responsibility to honor his life here today. I feel like I have to. Like, I, we, I always followed the story just because it was sad. And, you know, growing up right there, I just feel connected to it. Reverend Christopher Walsh acknowledging how difficult it is to confront awful abuses like this in our world, but adamant that we must indeed acknowledge. And abuse and neglect of children has been a secret in our church and in this parish and in our neighborhoods for far too long. There are children who are being hurt today. We have to talk about it and we have to do something. The message is clear today, not just honoring this young boy, but also sending out a message that if you're aware of child abuse or if you are going through abuse, that you can reach out or that you should notify somebody of a child in danger so that child can be saved. In Fox Chase, Marcus Espinosa, Fox 29 News.